the most strongest memories I have about growing up in Panama, um, visiting the city and going through the big Panama Canal Bridge and crossing El Puente de las Americas, which is amazing, and seeing El Cerro Ancon um, to the left hand side when we're driving in and our very beautiful Panamanian flag flying up high in Cerro Ancon. Uh, and then far in the distance, the Miraflores locks as well. Then we would drive into uh, what we call El Casco Viejo. And there you can get out of your car, walk around and have a look at some of the beautiful molas that the indigenous people will be actually sewing in selling stands that they, they put up through all along the Casco Viejo. The molas originated with the Gunayala indigenous people in, in Panama and um, this was their traditional um, dress but before that, prior to the mola actually being put into material and sewing, uh, it was believed that it was actually used as a tattoo uh, to scare the evil spirits away. The sewing of the molas as well is something that is, is created in the mind of the women. It's nothing that it's actually on a piece of paper drawn and then transpired into a piece of material. The women in Panama um, also have make our polleras and most clothing. They're called artesanas. The traditional color of the pollera montuna, which is what I'm wearing, is green. So the whole work will actually take somebody around about two years to, to complete the, the full work of the, of the, um, the top. El polleron, what we call el polleron, is made with a lot of volume so that when we are moving la pollera, we actually look like, you know, we've got a lot of um, volume that we can lift with the pollera so in any given day wearing this all day it's actually tiring there are many different designs to polleras and many different pieces of jewelry that we wear as well with la pollera I know that you know what I'm wearing is not everything that I could be wearing with my pollera montuna but I am in Australia so I'm happy to be able to wear what I am and I'm very proud of it